committee is also considering the Advancing Research and Education Act, which would reauthorize the Education Sciences Reform Act, or ESRA. Uh, sounds like a rock band from a few decades ago. <laughs> They won't let me take questions, but boy, I have have the answers to everything. Patrick, I think a good time to exit. Everything. I have the answers to everything. We're not, we're allies, but we're not members, members of NATO. So that's why I think I will pass this question to (laughs) our big friend, President Biden. Look. And my concern is that Weiss may have, uh, indicted hunter biden to protect him from ah, having to be deposed yes in the in the house oversight committee yes. on wednesday he but indicted we- him to protect him yes the classic rubric he indicted him to protect him i got it well look this whole this, this jake this whole thing's been about a cover-up you know you've got two that's why he indicted him to, to protect him to, to cover it up well he look you indict him on the least little thing the gun charge and not paying taxes. He's facing like 17 additional years in prison. Hey James, just wanted to stop by to congratulate you for being the largest landowner in your county with your brother through all your LLCs. I think it's amazing that you share a passion for Smurfs and the Pink Panther. Look, congrats on your promotion. I hope that the struggles of this year's don't transfer to next year and that you slay and kill it. I want to wish you, James, a very happy Hanukkah. Bye. I can't get an answer. I don't think members of the Oversight Committee could get an answer, uh, or the Ways and Means Committee, or the Judiciary Committee. I don't think there is an answer. There's not, and of course it's unsurprising because according to even Fox News correspondents, House Republicans have been unable to make any kind of connection to a a constitutional high crime and misdemeanor. The House Oversight Committee has been at this for years and they have so far not been able to provide any concrete evidence that Joe Biden personally profited from his son Hunter's overseas business, but they are gonna try again. You got a president, Joe Biden, who's cognitively gone. Why don't you get with his, his analysts, whoever it is? I do disagree vehemently with what you've said. Have you spent any time with Mr. Biden, with the president? Good God, Did you go, no. Lord. Good God, no. No, you've been watching a little too much Fox News. Mr. Speaker, the ancient Greeks would have appreciated the irony of this story. Kevin McCarthy spent his life preparing for the job that he held for just 269 days. So it seems like it, it would be good to quote the bard so i come to this house floor to praise mccarthy not bury him this week the wizards and capitals look to be finding a new home in virginia some republicans are saying that crime is a key factor in this decision do you think the american people are weary on democrats when it comes to the issue of crime first of all i'm a long-suffering jets fan so uh, (laughs) i haven't really been able to follow the uh, goings and comings of the wizards in the capitals. We have five minutes, so if I interrupt you, I'm not being rude. Or maybe I'm being rude, but that's the reason. Uh, Our traditional choice of dairy has always been whole milk. We want only the most nutritional option for Santa. I love milk. I don't know who, but somebody bought me a little thing of milk. Um, And this one will not go to waste because it's actually whole milk and I love it in my lattes. God promised Abraham a land flowing of milk and honey. I'll uh, let the body decide what type of milk Abraham or the Lord was um, promising Abraham. I think I know. Nobody told me there'd be days like these. And I urge my colleagues to support this bipartisan, bicameral and utterly fantastic bill. And let's not skim over the facts here. Whole milk is truly the cream of the crop in delivering these key vitamins and nutrients to growing children. So let's not curdle away the opportunity to expand dairy consumption in our nation's schools and ensure our children are getting the nutrients necessary to grow strong bones and teeth. Mr. Speaker, all milk puns aside, I urge my colleagues to support this legislation. Ow! My bones are so brittle. But I always drink plenty of... milk? 
Before I start talking, I just want to take a quick drink of this super delicious milk. I see you're drinking 1%. Is that because you think you're fat? Because you're not. You could be drinking whole if you wanted to. You can see, um... <laughs> Where's my Popeye? Good, you're here. Um... I think if there was a Mount Rushmore of New Jersey, he might be eligible to stand up upon that pantheon of some of the great Jerseyans like Bruce and Bon Jovi. He is a rock star, at least in our office. So in 1992, I was redistricted from my Brooklyn district to Queens into a significantly Jewish neighborhood. And a lady came over to me and said, you're Congressman Schumer. And I said, yes, ma'am, I am. She said, I've never met you before, but I watch C-SPAN religiously and I want to pay you a compliment. And I said, thank you, ma'am. She said, of all the 435 members of the Congress, you have more courage than anyone else. I said, well, what do you mean by that, ma'am? I know some of them, we call them no good mix, but some of them are very good people. What makes you say I have more courage than any other? She said, well, as I said, I've never met you in person, but I watch C-SPAN religiously, and when you rise to your feet to speak, you're the only one who has the courage to wear a yarmulke. I said, thank you, ma'am. It's obvious you've never met me in person. It's not a yarmulke. <laughs>